Hello there, it's Mark from Retro Caravan Renaults. Welcome to Opal. So this is a 1977 Viscount Supreme. Uh, we found it in a yard in Toowoomba. It's been sitting there uh, empty for quite some time. And a lovely couple, Ainsley and Gloria from Tasmania, put their foot on it and said, we'll have that. So for the last few months, we have done a complete ground up restoration, as you can see. So it's, it's been completely resprayed. Now when we respray them, we respray what we have. Um, so the, obviously it's a 45 or 47 year old van, whatever it is. And uh, you know, they have stories to tell, but certainly the color they've chosen is, is incredible. They had opal put on both sides and the back. We've polished the J-rails, brand new uh, tail rail, all new lighting. So this van was completely stripped, just a shell sitting in a paddock. So it's had the old, the terrible old school um, support legs taken off and four brand new stabilizers put on. This has got a massive storage box. It's about seven feet long that goes underneath. So we just had it all registered for them yesterday. So if you want to come on through, come down to this side. <coughs> We've custom made these uh, lovely spats. If you stand over here, my beautiful partner Kaz is doing the video work. So Callum, our head guy in the factory, has custom made these lovely spats. All brand new wheels and tires. Put some really nice hubcaps on them. Um, so this van's, uh, it had a, terrible old school door on so it's got a brand new door uh, that we got from Aussie Traveller and it's got uh, a very heavy duty screen that not even your cat can destroy if you've got a cat and inside that it's got another Midgey screen so it's a, it's a fantastic quality door so if we come around to the front we've kept the old badge on it <laughs> um, new uh, jockey wheel uh, we've uh, put a second chain on it only had one chain so we've put a nice big sexy heavy duty train uh, Weld Crow put all of the stabilizers on and also uh, tucked the spare tire underneath. So we had a bracket welded up from underneath. If you come in here, Kaz, I'll show you. Um, Ainsley and Gloria have asked for a box to be put on the front. So we lined the box and got a couple of um, chocks in there for the wheels and the and the, um, the whizzer for the uh, stabilizers. I'm sure it's not called the whizzer. <coughs> so we get all brand new stickers as well. So that's the outside. Come on inside and have a look. So we actually only just put the door on yesterday that arrived lastminute.com even though it's getting delivered today. <laughs> There's been problems with COVID and deliveries uh, all around the country. So come on inside. So this van, as I said, was completely stripped. Um, it was right back to just the frame. There was no walls, no wiring, no nothing. So everything you see in here, we've built. Uh, it had all brand new wiring. We had a Sparky that came in and laid all the wiring out because we got the design from Ainsley and Gloria first that they wanted. So then the Sparky comes in and puts all the wiring in. We then insulate it, put all new ceilings and walls, and then we start the cabinetry work. So come on in. Um, it's got a nice new range hood that you can see there. Ainsley and Gloria have got double blinds, so they get a nice darker color at the front and a nice beige at the back. All new fly screens, new Kamek sink, beautifully polished timber tops. We put the Copper Caravan uh, uh, latches on there to keep everything all nice and locked. We fix a fire extinguisher inside there. This one actually has a really cool hot water system, which is great. What else? They've had a, oh, there's a, the fire alarm, of course. We always put the fire alarm in all of the, the vans. They've chosen a really nice, chic, uh, retro style fridge. It's not a full size fridge, but certainly not a small caravan fridge. It's, a, it's a, definitely a three quarter size fridge, which is fantastic. If you look at the lounge here, um, Gloria has chosen an absolutely beautiful fabric. So there's one plain uh, olivey sort of color on the bottom and then the patterned uh, on the top. We had an extra couple of cushions done up as a surprise for them. Uh, going through, we've got all the shelving up the back here. Inside here is the uh, mains, the fuse box. Uh, over here, we always put in most of the, well, most of the vans anyway, a, a four game or four outlet. Sorry, that was spiky talk. A, a four uh, outlet, two USB uh, plug there. The remote control for the air conditioner, which I think I might just put on right now. It's a really hot, hot day here in Ballina. And it's got a little light as well, which is great. Get that on because they're going to be here in the next 20 minutes or so. Um, all right, what else? Uh, queen size bed, brand new beautiful mattress from Harvey Norman. And we put 250 newton meter two, uh, twin gas struts on it. So that just sits up by itself. A huge amount of storage under there. A couple of little handles here to help pick it up. So 
What else? What else? Uh, the Four Seasons hatch, all brand new, of course, because the old hatches in these caravans can be a bit of an issue. Um, we've fitted uh, a nice mirror that we framed up over here, and in the back here, in the bedroom, we've got these pretty fancy uh, push-shut drawers. Uh, they only wanted a single wardrobe, so we're going to come through and just put a single wardrobe in there because they're not going to be carrying around too many suits and so on and so forth. Uh, table on a nice pedestal base which slides both ways and uh, actually spins around as well. So what we do for all customers is we then use the spare key for their door, create a nice little uh, welcome kit which welcomes them to Opal and tells them what a pleasure it's been for us to create this dream van for them. And then we put all of the uh, documents for the air conditioners, the stoves, the range hoods, the fridges, all that sort of stuff. So we put all their owners' manuals and warranty forms in there so they've got them all in one place. I can't think what else to say. The blinds have really set it off beautifully, I think. All new screens, etc. as we said. We put a little TV point in here because the power's underneath, so they're going to have a little TV there. Um, it's, been a, it's been an absolute pleasure. Sorry, I'm six foot two, so I'm quite near the ceiling on this van. Uh, but it's been a pleasure for us to make this Branson and Gloria. They're a lovely couple, and uh, I'm sure they're going to be travelling around Australia and having a great time in this van. Uh, we had it weighed actually yesterday to get it registered, and um, even though we put quite a, a bit of new stuff and a 34 kilo air conditioner and so forth on the top, it still came in at 1580, so 1580 kilos, which is great for an 18 foot. This is a big van. It's an 18 foot uh, tandem axle van. So, all right. Signing off now, thanks for watching.